Hi everybody. Well, um, I've been doing some uh, cleaning up of my um, ATCs and so I thought that today I would just um, do kind of a flip through of um, the ATCs that I have uh, done because I haven't, you know, looked at them for a long time and uh, I have this shoe box which has some of them in and I'll show you the um, new thing that I got to put them in which is great so I have them in these uh, little folders and I have to make sure that when I'm showing them uh, that says smile it's got a little baby outfit. This one's birds. Now these are a little bigger than uh, the regular ATCs. I can't get them in ATC folders. Uh, this one I really like. It's, um, oops, sorry. it's a dragon with uh, gems underneath. And uh, this is just flowers with a heart. Uh, these are two bird ones. Try not to get the glare on them. Uh, that looks like one of my little things. Of I have dangles on these, and some of the dangles are actually covering the pictures now. I used to belong to um, Jamie's group and she has these digis that you can play with and um, they're, they're very cool. This one's a crown. I think it's one of those uh, no, I better not say because maybe it's not. It's a little house. I have a lot. Uh, there's another one. A couple little cutesy ones. If anybody wants to trade, again, I know there's clubs out there, but I don't seem to be able to uh, find them. That's a bird. I have quite a few of these. ones that I have put um, flowers on, one of these, they uh, take up too much room for the little pockets. I like that one, that's T tea one. Not too crazy about that one, but I like that one. Flower one. Sorry for the glare. That one's cute. That's just a little tag. This is a bigger one. These are... Oops. I like that mushroom one. I like anything with bling on it. Glitter. I like this bicycle one too.
These are bigger ones. They're more like iCAD cards. I don't know which way that one goes. I'm going to try to do pictures and put them on Facebook. So you can look under my Facebook account, which is Sheila McNabb, and uh, get a better look. this one or not. I don't know whether it showed this one or not. They're all slipping all over the place. And, oops. These are more iCAD size. have this one that's a plaque more like I think I showed you this one already last video and this is a dog one I ran out of folders so that's why they're not in a folder uh, Just give me a minute, and I'll put those back, and we'll be good to go for the next set. So how's everybody been? This is Sunday, and of course I'm watching Walking Dead, my favorite show. Although nothing too exciting is happening right now. Well, I should say that there's always something exciting happening, but, you know, not earth-shattering. It's the only uh, show that I really watch uh, during the week. A lot of problems getting downstairs now. And, uh, even more getting up. So, I don't like to come down and... Unless I have more than one reason. Okay, I can put that box back. Okay, I went to... I'm moving the camera just for a second. I'm sorry to get this down. I went to um, the ATC store. And uh, I'm going to move this camera just up a little bit. And I bought this... Um, it's a stand. I don't know how I can show it to you without everything falling off. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah, here. It's kind of a stand with everything on it. ATC cards. Let's see if I can move it over. And I think this is great because if I get... Um, kind of down, you know, you can look at your little pieces of art to give you uh, some mojo to get started on any on something else. Now these are all ATC cards that I have done. I have quite a few of them. But this makes it easy to get them. I like this one, the little theater. Uh, get them on and off. And 
There's a Canadian one for you. Little beach scene. And dining room. Dining set. Little coffee thing. And they just slide back on. They have a little hole at the top. So it takes you like two seconds to get them on. And I'm just putting this on my desk, even though I cleaned off my desk. Now I'm cluttering it up again. And um, using them to uh, use for my mojo. So if I get, like I can't think I could make anything, I can pull these out and see what I've done before. Some of these are real pretty. I've forgotten that I had done them actually. And uh, it was kind of nice to put them in these little things and uh, hang them. I could put it somewhere else and, you know, somebody could flip through them. Take which ones they like to take. I might do that. I might put it upstairs. Uh, I like this one too. There's a few favorites that I might make a little album out of. Uh, I bought a little album set too um, from these and uh, you know take the ones that are your favorites. I like this one with the talking fish. And that one's pretty. They're all nice, but like I said, some are better than others. I like this needle and thread one too. Now I think that years ago I got these in a set. You know, from one of those little bags. I don't know what they're called now. And they have little different things in them. Now this has feathers on it. I know you won't be able to see that, but some of them are similar. Must be that I was on a roll that day. I'd like to get a little more into layering. I know I showed this one last week. I kind of have put them all on there that I had. So I can't remember, oh I know I showed you that one last week, and that one last week, and that one, and that one, and that's new. Well not new, they're all old, but revamped for me, let's put it that way. And now I have some on the top rungers. Three rungs, and I think they hold about ten cards each rung, depending on how thick yours are. Now, mine's are fairly thick because my husband used um, wood, and I've got um, all little wood in there that they're on, so they're fairly thick. Now, some that are really thin that are just on um, paper, like these ones. And I think you could get more on. That's a Halloween one. I like these little ones with the little pictures in them. I have a lot of those. That's on burlap. So, um, yeah, depending on Uh, I got about two more rows here. Okay. This little mailbox. This is just giving you some ideas of um, what you can use. Like I said, I have a lot of these uh, picture ones. I like these with the 
cogs on them. I have a couple of those. There's an Eif Eiffel Tower one. Rose. And so you kind of get the idea. Um, like I said, I really like this stand. You can fit quite a few on it. There's three rungs, and so I can put about 60 on here. 60, 65, depending on, uh, you know, how thick they are. Seems if they have bling on them, they really pick up the light. That's it for how many I've made. So I have a few and I'm still making them. I just kind of organized my uh, box to do some more. But I'm trying to do some layered ones so I, I want to do that. And um, I got a little box now. These have colored cards in them that I'm going to play around with and uh, see what I can do and just a little box it doesn't shut because I got too many in there but that's all my ATC cards that I have yet to do these ones are a little thicker uh, yeah so we'll see how it goes but I'm continuing to do them uh, like I said, normally I do them on cards, but I uh, bought these the other day to try them out and see if I don't have to use cards. Um, but I appreciate everybody watching. It's kind of what I've been doing right now is these ATC cards. Uh, quite a few of them, actually. So, um, you know, if you're interested in swapping or you have got any questions about them, uh, be sure to ask me because I have done a multitude of them so as you can see and subscribe I'm uh, not doing any uh, demos or tutorials uh, tonight I I'm uh, just kind of did this and so I thought I'd share it with you to uh, give you some ideas about uh, different things that you can put on ATC's I've seen some real beautiful ones out there. Um, so there's lots of videos on it. Like I said, I'm, I'm going to try to get into some layering. So I'm, I'm going to work on that. And uh, I'll be back if I can master it, which I don't seem to do very well. But if I can get it so that I can actually layer some. Uh, I'll be back to show you how they turn out and then Maybe I'll do a tutorial. So thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe. Thank you.